this roundabout um, is uh, um, being set up in such a way that we are able to have uh, two vehicles entering at the same time and uh, um, exiting. One of our major challenges is working on ensuring that people know how to use the roundabout. So we are setting up our education awareness program to address the issue. In terms of uh, the completion date for the roundabout, we are aiming at somewhere in June, July, August of this year. Probably you would say, but I thought it should have been completed earlier. Probably yes, but um, in construction or when you're doing um, different type of work, um, you will have, you do have delays in, in some areas in terms of uh, the setting out because we need to ensure that all the testings are being done. And um, so we use a nuclear densimeter to ensure that compaction is at the minimal standard defined by the Ministry of Works. If that standard is not met, um, then we can issue um, notices to com continue with the other work. So we, we ensure that all the, the, method, the, the, techni the, the technical aspects are being addressed before we venture into the other stage. We need to ensure that the setting takes place and to have setting it takes time. So you might have 30 days for one process to set. Now in that um, interim we have um, climatic conditions that we have to work along with. So you're either in a too dry season or a too wet season and how do we work out that balance? And um, with, with those aspects we do have delayed but I rest assured the aim is to have value for money um, invested in the setting up of this area.